you move forward onto the field in 2015 as a member of the Big Ten. It's the first year of Big Ten lacrosse. It's the first time Hopkins has ever been part of a conference. You've been independent for all those years. What does joining the Big Ten mean to Johns Hopkins? 15 years ago when I took the job here, if you asked me would we ever be a part of a conference, I would tell you no, no way, and I would probably be a bit arrogant about it. We, take, we, we took so much pride in our independence. So did Syracuse. You know that. You were part of that. And that was our thing. That was what made us unique and different. As a program, sometimes you have to reinvent yourself. And given the lay of the, the land and the landscape of athletics and lacrosse and all this conference realignment, my job is to lead this program and always do what's in the best interest of the players and of the program. That comes before me and my staff and what was in the best interest of this program moving forward and securing the future of this program. I felt, we felt, our AD felt, our, our, our president felt, and the committee we put together to research all this felt joining a conference was the most important thing we could do. And then it was, well, what conference? And we had some, we had some different opportunities. And at the end of the day, the Big Ten is a world-class conference. Uh, there are some similar academic institutions, research institutions that are terrific schools in the Big Ten. Athletics is top flight in the Big Ten. Uh, you know, from football and basketball on to baseball and other sports. And we felt like there was going to be the kind of commitment that we wanted from a conference when we joined the Big Ten. And, and, and you know, and the other thing is that when we recruit, we want to recruit guys that want to be here at Hopkins. We don't want to have to talk people into it. Well, we wanted a conference that wanted us. And the Big Ten accepted Johns Hopkins as its first ever affiliate member. That tells you an awful lot about their commitment to us. And we just felt like their priorities and our priorities were in line and that it was a good fit for Hopkins lacrosse now and in the future.